Hello everyone and welcome to the European Fashion Accelerator Program 2020. Let me introduce short history and main idea of the event first. European Fashion Accelerator Program was founded by Karolina Bosakova and her team Unique One Events in the Czech Republic to support young fashion designers from V4. This program teaches young talented fashion design students every year to succeed in global fashion industry. This year we would like to present a series of educational videos with a fashion workshops where we will focus on teamwork, panel interviews on sustainability and the program also includes a presentation of selected talents from fashion schools and their amazing work. So actually my history comes from fashion industry. I started as a model when I was 17 years old and then I traveled the world and I did the whole big thing. Ten years after that I returned back to Prague, my hometown, and I actually realized what a huge gap is on the fashion market here. So my first kind of intention was to create Fashion Week concept in this region, in Czech and Slovakia, and that worked out successfully. And when we already had the very successful commercial platform of Fashion Week in our country, I always felt like it's really important to give space to young talents because the talents are the future of local fashion. We started European Fashion Accelerator in very strong cooperation with universities of art and design. So we every time talk to them and see what is the biggest need of the students and absolvents of these creative uh, topics. And based on the feedback from them, but also from the actual situation, we try to adapt the program the way that it's going to work for them the best way. We actually started already last year with a very important topic, which I see that is really the future, and it's the sustainability through talent development, because that's what we have been doing for years. And I think it's really important, because we have to share our good experience and business experience with the young talents to be able to help them to, to do a successful career. And why sustainability in general? It's um, obvious. I mean, now we see what's happening during the COVID crisis, but also what's happening with the planet. I think it's a topic that has to be really talked loud out. And especially now these days, I think that we have to really reconsider the business in general and see what could be the right new ways of doing fashion and still be creative. Uh, but I think it's a global topic that is so important that, uh, that we really have to think about it and, and I think that the time is right now. There's so many different approaches to sustainability. It can be the materials, it can be you know, the, the support of local designers. It can be many different things, and that is why we actually invited to this year European Fashion Accelerator program many experts from very different fields of the global business to actually ask these questions the right people. <laughs> because you can see it from the business perspective, but you can also see it from you know, the zero waste uh, side, you can see it you know, from really supporting the local producers. So there is many different ways, but uh, I think that everyone who does fashion can find a way how they can be sustainable. For me, it was always big topic or maybe different perspective from my side because I have a lot of international experience. And I think that we should not really focus on being local so much because the, the market became global with all e-commerce and all e-shops. So 
I think that we should not be afraid from the region of Central Europe to actually expand to global fashion market because we definitely have great stuff to offer to the rest of the world. And what I see with the mentality of Central Europe is that maybe there is lack of self-confidence a little bit. And with European Fashion Accelerator, we want to change that because we think that the talent is here and many talents can actually make it big to the global market.